Kangaroos of UMKC entering the Hodge Center for the first time ever to start the new year. And 2016 gets started on the right foot for the Upstate Spartans. A late basket, they take the lead for the final time. Inside of 10 seconds left and win it 70-68, Tom. Heck of a ball game. It was back and forth, a seven point lead for Upstate at half, of, uh, made it 11 of the second half. UMKC would take the lead late, but then uh, Mike Cunningham would eventually hit that big three pointer with about nine seconds to go and then held off uh, a final shot there at the end to come out with a two point win. The final bucket, not all Mike Cunningham did. You'll see him a lot in these highlights as we take a look back at the performances by both teams. Cunningham, big factor, along with Mike Buchanan, who you'll see inside, but the initial steps were taken by UMKC, and they were flying high, Tom. Yeah, Deshaun King, very athletic. I think this was a really good matchup between these two teams as well, but early on, able to hit some long-range jumpers, get a couple of alley-oops as well, but, you know, then back uh, come uh, USC say cut percent of the drive there, and a lot of contributions, particularly that young man who would eventually hit the three-pointer that turned out to be the winner of the ball game, Mike Cunningham. We'll see his numbers in just a moment. We also should point out Martez Harrison, who led the way for UMKC. Over 20 points in his performance in the loss of valiant effort and just came down to that one shot in the end, as you said, where the play was set up very nicely by Eddie Payne and his coaching staff. And here are the numbers. As you can see, the Kangaroos won the second half, but they end up losing the overall war because of that early deficit Upstate was able to build. Yeah, Cunningham comes off the bench, four of seven from three-point range. And I'll tell you, Michael Buchanan, big guy inside, veteran. He was big, particularly in the second half, went down deep to him able to score. That caused a double team later. He flipped one over for an easy assist. And, and I thought the last play that the three-pointer by Cunningham when uh, the timeout was called by the veteran head coach, uh, Eddie Payne knows what he's doing, right? <laughs> and got the ball in, went inside to Buchanan. The double came. It left Cunningham out on the edge. He was prepared to shoot the basketball, did in rhythm, knocked it down. And then the other way went to UMKC and had it roll off the rim and just out to uh, come out of here uh, with a two-point win for USC Upstate. All of that coming with just under 10 seconds left when Upstate took their lead for the final time. You can see the men's team in action once again on Tuesday night. We'll have it for you on ESPN3. There you can see the information on the bottom of your screen as North Carolina A&T comes to town. Final tune-up inside the Hodge Center before conference play begins. So on this first Saturday in 2016, the Spartans a two-point winner and a thriller over the Kangaroos of UMKC.